Um, find a mate. Hurry, the competition is quick. Yeah, that's not that's not gamey at all. Um, okay. So. And then they have a GPA and wealth and tokens that you can assess to make your decision. Well, I guess Abanique is the best. Yeah, she's she be easy to get to that space anyway. Yeah. Oh, they have bones. Oh, we can read their story. Oh, oh, oh I see. It's, it's just the okay, same one. Sad. Okay. But it, it gives us a record, I guess. Yeah. Well, I guess let's get it married then. Yep. I sure, mean, that's... That, that's the point of, that's yep. why we're going there. Osaze loved into disaster. What? Um. Um. Hmm. Sneaking up to a window to look upon Ebonique, he stumbled and landed in the garden mulch that graced Ebonique's family home. Wiping mud and young squash leaves from his face, Osaze withheld a swear. The hand that helped him helped to lift him was gentle. Osaze looked deep into laughing eyes. But Ebonique did not laugh. She smiled and held Osaze tight. Okay, is that good? Oh, friendship. And marriage, I guess. Okay. Oh, okay. At first I was like, oh yeah, friendship's good. And it's so like, oh, they're suddenly married? Well, I guess it's good that oh, they're okay. also friends. Well, I guess we have the flame. So who's the green person? I don't know. She's an ally. Okay. Oh. She boosts pawns. Oh, I guess if, if you go there, then... Okay. Hey, we got a child. Yay. She doesn't have a descriptor. She's not a maverick or anything. Ebonique, the husband-loving, I guess. I mean, I guess it's good that they love each other. I wonder if there's ever a couple where it's like, hates his wife. Yeah. That'd be kind of sad. Oh. Well, I guess if we give her an ingot, that will land her on the ally that boosts so want oh, to see what okay. happens? Sure. Nothing much. Okay. I don't know the rules of this game. <laughs> At the very least, she'd end up in the same spot as her husband, so... Oh, right. Impetus, Impetus of, love. of love. I forgot about that. Is and it we useful can... to have more than one baby? We'll see. Oh, every child is a chance to continue your dynasty. It heard you and answered your question. Oh. Should a descendant fail to have children, siblings let you try again. That's good. Okay. I, I guess. So that one has hair. Does that mean it's a girl? Yeah. Girls have hair. Boys don't. I don't know how to feel about that. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably their culture. Yeah, we'll chalk it up to that. Woo! And we could have another baby. <laughs> I mean, it makes me feel a little bit more secure than just yeah. having the one kid before. Which makes me feel kind of bad to say. But... I think that's basically how people thought about having children in those days anyway. Um, but then I don't know if we should boost, like, all their skills? Probably not. Just, like, focus on one of them? Hmm. I, I guess? Because we wouldn't I... have enough tokens for all of them. 
oh man, this really is how people thought back then. <laughs> <laughs> then and then nobody cares about you, Kanamum. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. No one cares about you. Oh, he, he took a default action. I don't know what this means. Did we lose a legend point? Um, I don't know. Oh, well, I guess... So you... I don't know what any of this means. So he learned a little bit, but not as well? I don't remember how many we had before. Neither do I. I guess next time we'll keep track. Yeah. Hmm? Oh, that's okay. Did he gain any skill or is he... Nah. It would probably... I think before it showed like a little arch, ghost arch yeah. hovering around his head. And we haven't actually seen any gold beads at all. They must be really rare. Maybe they only exist on the higher status levels. That would make sense, actually. Like, oh, you can only afford gold if, like, you're elite. All of our kids are going to be bad at brewing. <laughs> I guess that's how it perpetuates itself. Yeah. All right, 49. So the uh, other kid did something. It said oh, bead. But we didn't... Oh, no, it was just someone getting a bead. That's why yeah. I said bead lost. So we still okay. have 49. Kid got a little bit of brewing skill. Yay. <laughs> so if we just leave him alone, maybe he'll actually get more <laughs> brewing skill than any of us. Yeah, maybe we'll have someone who can actually brew. <laughs> maybe we should care about that kid by neglecting him. <laughs> <laughs> sure, that's good parenting, right? Yeah. And it's like, I feel like this is not a game for indecisive people, which is what I am. Because every turn it's like, okay, now should I, like, uh, make tokens or get ahead or what exactly to do? Yeah, that's how I think also. And it's not even like, very interesting choices. It's just uh, very small mechanical choices. I think she should make tokens because yeah, I was thinking she's so. pretty far behind. But yeah, well, she she'd get caught like the next yeah, one so back. she wouldn't get that far behind. Ah, yes, we got another brewing token. Yay! <laughs> of course, that's the only way that he can move forward. Dang Unless you have him also make tokens. All right. Oh, green. Oh, and we can get it too. Oh, well, we better do that. Um, we could even get it and the half. Eh, that's okay. <laughs> um, or we could even get it and the full one because she's a booster. Oh, of course, yeah. that would use our last brewing token, but... Yeah, decisions. Oh, man. Who should get the green bead? <laughs> okay. All right. Ooh, we're getting we're close. close. <laughs> Actually, and... that's a four, isn't it? There's yeah. four points for this, so we'll, we'll yeah. get it. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Uh, wait, I saw some yellow text. I don't know. Oh, it's just... It stays oh, behind wait, something after about... a while. Oh, it's click on the burial icon. Yeah, it, it just okay. stays behind. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Ugh. The owl button presents a brief tale about the family. Oh, wait. Uh, uh, what, what, okay. A tale in the life of Osaze. Personality determined his reaction. For the result, click the owl. Uh, the year's harvest was immense. 
Amphorae for storage were in desperate demand. Masase traded, for, traded the family savings for a potter's wheel. He hoped never to plow or weed again, but how to begin? Then it's Osaze practiced throwing pots at the family. Osaze watched other potters ply their craft, copied the farm's existing pottery, or started making pots for sale right away. I feel like if his personality determines the result, we should do something that fits with his personality being the loving. Yeah, which I feel like would be the family one. I agree. So let's click on the family owl. They grew hungrier and hungrier in a time of feasting. Their youngest nearly died. Eventually oh. his skills improved and people actually paid for his pots. Other potters shunned Osaze. That oh. sounds bad. Yeah, it does. Oh, we have a whole new set of tokens. Oh, we, we went up. Oh, because their goal was to advance in social status? Um... Oh, I guess so. So I guess if you choose that, then that's what makes them climb the wheel next. Okay, so what are the other two if you... High risk for a variety of gains. Winning a heroic challenge provides advantages against all challenges of the age. I don't even know what a challenge of the age is yet. Oh, I guess there's something there. <laughs> I guess we can click on that to find oh, out what it means. It says it still right? won't arrive for a long time. I don't know how many turns that is, but... With... And then this one is, um... Inventions provided for Oh, like the arch. Yeah. Um... Right, so what's this again? Um... You must... They must survive... Oh, maybe that's why you want to have children... Extra children, because you must survive heroic circumstances that ended the age. Usually when all the tracks discoveries have been made. All discoveries? I feel like Maybe. that will take a long time. <laughs> I guess I didn't think about how long the game would be. I thought it would be kind of short. But, you know, if you have to, like, make all discoveries each age, then... Uh. Okay. And it's one family making all these discoveries. We're the special family. Yeah. Unless other people make advances in between and we find out about them. I don't know, do you want to do invention again? or? Yeah, I kind of liked invention. Okay. What is this even talking about? If you don't click the owl, the story will still affect the family. Whatever you say. Oh, when you were making when we were making the decisions, there was an owl there. Yeah, I know. The owl on the left, so maybe we needed to click on the owl rather than just the story. Maybe. Okay, so what are all these new things? There's sailing, forging, wheel and axle, and plow, and we only have one of each. Okay, and I guess the arch and the irrigation aren't down here anymore anyway. Yeah. Like, so... Oh, and they're all bad at all that, so it's only their children who might get good at the new skills. Oh. Uh... Interesting. So what are their... Are, are, the, are the children all the same at those, or...? Um, variety of C's. Okay. Okay. And yeah, the beads are better, so I guess social advancement means better beads. Wait, where are we? Are we the red people? I think... Yeah, we're up here. We already oh. did our turns. Like, to get oh, so the we, beads to advance. Oh, okay. So I so, guess we need... Uh, I don't know if it is worth anything to keep giving our kids these tokens, because we've advanced. Yeah. 
Let's and try giving an ingot to the kid we don't care about. Okay. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> our dear other child. <laughs> yes, our, our dear, what's his name? Kanaman. Yeah, that sounds we, Egyptian. We love that guy. Okay. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, they learned stuff. Yeah, I saw like three things going around on there. Spend tokens for another track to reach beads on that track. How does that work? Do you can can you like so go back and forth? So if we spent an arch, we could go down, and then we could go back up again. I guess. <laughs> Come on! Why'd you give us more arches? We're done with that. I guess because he's good at it. Yeah, I know. They're not adapted to their new station in life. <laughs> I guess our booster friend isn't there anymore. No. Maybe, I mean, she might still be uh, doing menial stuff. Yeah. Oh. And we're, we, we became artisans, but uh, that doesn't mean all our friends became artisans, too. <laughs> And we just abandoned them. Yeah. Yay. Fun times. And turn. Uh, unless we want to, because we now have two wheels. So if we want to use one of the wheels to help a kid. Uh, they still just feel so precious, though, because we're not good at making any of them. Yeah. But I know we'll have to teach them at some point or they won't be good at making them either. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, hey, hey our there's our ally boost is friend. Still there. <laughs> oh, I think that's a different name, though. Oh, is it? Yeah, yeah, it is, I think. It's good that you're enjoying it anyway. I'm not sure uh, how much of this will actually end up playing, but. Because um, I don't know if we'll do like a full playthrough, because, like I said, like making all discoveries, that seems like a lot for each yeah. age, and I think. Since it's called Seven Grand Steps, I feel like there's seven ages, maybe? Yeah, well, Copper Age sounds pretty early. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, there could be, like, Copper, Bronze, Iron, I don't know, Medieval, Industrial, Computer, Future. Well, let me see. That uh, shadow person is... Oh, Gold! gold. I don't think we can get there, though. Uh, I guess the guy is the closest, because if we give him a plow... He would get to this half bead. Yeah. But then we wouldn't have another plow until we made more tokens. Yeah. <laughs> so we could have her make tokens and see what she makes. Sure. Oh, man. Okay, they didn't... None of you get the gold bead. They didn't get the gold, uh. okay. Yeah. <laughs> man. I don't think we need another kid at this point. Is there any reason to not have another kid? Oh, right, I guess we can just ignore it. Oh. <laughs> well, now we have two clouds. Yeah, now we do. Wow. Maybe there'll be half of it left. Wait, he disappeared. Yeah. <laughs> Is that supposed to happen? I don't know. He just, like, went all the way down. <laughs> I hope he's not. He's, I hope he's, he's okay. He's very tired. <sighs> they didn't get it. I think so. They're learning. They're learning on their own. Well, I think the crocodiles ate someone, but we have a gold bead. 
Oh, yeah. Yay. Who cares about dead people? We can get gold. <laughs> it's only like <laughs> 10 points, but it's still like gold. Yeah. It feels satisfying. <laughs> Oh, come on. We only have sailing left. Oh. And other than that, it's just moving down. Well, I don't think we can afford to educate our children, so... <laughs> They're on their own. And still can't afford to educate our children. Good luck. Yep. They seem to be doing better without us anyway. Well, I mean, their skills still aren't that great. Oh, oh wow. He's he actually, good at his wheel. Yeah. He got an interest. Oh, I guess they might have developed a certain interest. He is good at wheel and axle. She's good at sailing. He's just a good for nothing, which we already knew. No one yeah. likes Kanaman. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, they're wearing fancy clothes. Did they just get those? Because I don't remember that. Yes. Yes, they did. Okay. Why? Why now? Oh. Oh, hey. Uh, oh, hey. <laughs> we didn't have a family name until now. What should we call them? See, I always spend way too long on that kind of thing because it's... Oh no, more choices! For some reason, like, the only thing that I thought of was we could call ourselves the Kanamans after the kid we don't <laughs> like! Oh. We could name them Turnip Sock. I mean, I guess Turnip Sock would include both, like, Turnip from their agrarian lifestyle and sock from their artisan lifestyle. Yeah. <laughs> so like that? Sure. Oh, I see. And then we could boost any of our kids. But we wouldn't do that guy. <laughs> no. Oh, and I see we're pretty close to the end of the line. Right, yeah. Well... We could have him make tokens, or we could have him get one last bead. <laughs> it's like, this game should not require this much thought. So I think we should just age him up if you're... Okay. Because I think... All right, do you want to read this right? Sure. The ready sons of tradesmen were called to the river at the start of summer. They wore simple, clean tunics. The priests would bless them as they might a bull of rare size. I guess they're classist. Oh, I guess the owl, if we click on the owl, is that a... It doesn't do anything. Oh. Okay. I thought since it talked about clicking on owls earlier, we needed to it click would... on the owl. The owl is a lie. Oh. <laughs> they preached... Your skills are given by the gods. They created people to labor for them after their divine servants refused simple trades work. Ply your craft long and well, then rest content in the lands of the dead, free from need, empty and eternal. Sala entered the temple but avoided the ceremony. No one commented on his absence when he joined his friends to celebrate afterwards. Thereafter, people would call him Sala the... And I wonder if these are just random, or if they're partially um, influenced by what ring you're on. Yeah, I don't know, because these are different. There's not even an overlap. Well, since we're going from discovering something, maybe inspired would be smart. Yeah. If it, if it affects anything, but... Oh, they have different burial rites. Ah, uh, but... And the other two don't. They're all behind us! If we made tokens. 
that oh. would make us move backward. Yes. Ah, oh, phew. Bacternal. Oh, I didn't even check her GPA uh -oh. or wealth, but... It uh, looks pretty good. Yeah. And, yes, I, I approve when they feel love. Yeah. Um, I don't know what I'd do if, like, we had one where it was impossible to get to one of them with a heart. It would be sad. Yeah. It was the first time that Saleh came to market with his own weights of exchange. He had visited Bakhtuernel's stall many times before, running errands for his parents. However, on that day, the young and clever vendor bargained most unfairly, claiming that random people nearby were crippled or sickly relatives she had to support. After nearly an hour of exchanging ridiculous offers, Bakhtuernel agreed to marry Saleh. Um... Okay, that's an interesting tale. Yeah, they are fancy outfits more. Jumoke. He's awful at everything. He's a newborn. <laughs> I mean, I don't know, when we raised our cast, all of our kids got, like, C's and everything. Automatically. Oh, right. So she's good at the plow. Mm. Nobody's good at forging. Nope. Uh. Oh, how oh, close? we're getting close. Yeah. Five more points. Okay. And then we can probably have her make stuff, because... Yeah. Sala showed the crude papyrus he had made to a master scribe. He berated Sala for disturbing a meal and tossed it upon the floor of his fine home. His younger, youngest child found it and promptly smeared it with pomegranate-stained fingers. When she gurgled, our youngest child is a boy. <laughs> well, we'll see... What comes up okay. from this one? <laughs> when she gurgled over the picture she'd made, her father looked at the sheet and then to the stack of clay tablets against the wall. Oh, I guess he it's paid... the guys, the other guys, the scribe's oh. child. Okay, the master scribe's child. That makes more sense. And then to the stack of clay tablets against the wall, he paid Sally well for the method of its making. I guess we're discovering paper. Something related to writing, I think. Well, I guess we'll see. He's looking towards the clay tablets and he's like, oh, oh yes, right. paper. Oh. Uh, Why is it plowing that's getting upgraded? <laughs> oh, well, I'm not complaining. We got 10 of them. I'm not quite sure what this is. It sounds like, you know, it's risky, but. Yeah, I don't know what we gained from it. Yeah. It's the one that we haven't tried yet, so oh. why not see what it is? Yeah, yeah, sure. Okay. Also, Does it explain well. anything if we hover over it? Uh. Mm. No. Nah. It's oh, just... well, that time it is a girl. The story was prophetic. Okay, so he is still pretty bad at everything. Yeah. Um. He's really bad at everything. Oh, he's doing pretty well at papyrus. Yeah. She didn't learn anything. Well, I mean. She's young. She she was just born. She's so. only had one turn. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's like. This kid, I don't know what he's doing. His younger brother is better at better than him already. Yeah. 